<laughs> Olivia, what are we gonna draw today? A fish tank. Yeah, a fish tank or a fish bowl. Hey, and you have a little friend with you. Mm -hmm. What's her name? Um, I haven't decided a name. You haven't decided a name yet? Yeah. Should we just call her Bunny? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, you ready to draw? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna use crayons. We have a bunch of colors. We're gonna use yellow, blue. What's this color? Pink. Pink. Green. And orange. Orange. Now you could also use black, but we're gonna use black markers to yeah. draw with. And the reason why we're using a black marker is because we're using gel crayons. Yeah. And when we color with the crayons, it makes the black smear. Yeah. So we're gonna use markers first. So it doesn't smear. Yeah, so it doesn't smear. Let's first draw the top of our fish bowl. We're gonna draw a straight line across the top of our paper. Oh, I like how big you're gonna draw. Then let's draw a letter C on the left. Yes, curve, a curve. And we're gonna draw a backwards C on the other side. Yeah, just like that. Now we're gonna draw the shape of our fishbowl. We're gonna start here on this side and we're gonna draw a big curve. Whoa, look how big. Come around to the other side and connect over here. Oh, I like the shape of my fish tank. Ooh, oh, yes. Ah, <gasps> oh, you did it. And I love that our two fishbowls look a little different. Yeah. They're both turning out awesome. Mm -hmm. It's okay if their drawings look different too because the most important thing is to have fun and to practice. Yes, remember to have fun and practice. Your drawing doesn't have to look exactly like ours. Yeah. And in fact, if you want, they could change it too, huh? And colorful. Yeah, you could change the colors. Okay, should we keep drawing? Yeah. Okay, now let's draw the sand at the bottom of our fishbowl. I'm gonna draw a wavy line like this across the bottom down here. I love the shape of your fish tank. Oh, that's a cool bumpy line too. You wanna to connect it over to the side. There you go. Oh, it kinda of looks like grass too. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Okay, now let's draw our water up here at the top. So I'm gonna draw the same line, wavy line that goes across the top but of our not fish tank. This one. Oh yeah, this one maybe you can make it different so it's just nice water. Oh yeah, that's really cool. And you could connect it over on that side. I really like your water. Maybe there's a storm inside of your fish tank. Or a little one. Yeah, just a little one. <laughs> okay, now let's draw our fish. We could draw lots of fish, but let's just draw one. Yeah. We're gonna draw, like, let's draw it over here on the left side. Or cats will eat it. Oh yeah, lots of cats. Yeah, we could draw a cat getting into our fish tank too. Yeah. Look at that, it looks like a backwards C. Now let's draw the tail. We're gonna draw a line that comes up on the top and a line that comes down on the bottom. And then we can connect the top down to the bottom. And we could also draw the little eye for our fish. Oh, two eyes and a smile. <laughs> I like that a lot. I'm gonna draw a little smile like this. Oh, let's draw a fin on the top. We'll go up and down so it can swim. And let's draw a fin on the bottom too. Yeah, oh, and I like that yours, you have a smile right there. It kind of looks like a fin on the side. I'm gonna do a little fin like yours too. But you can leave it just like that. Okay, now let's draw seaweed in our fish tank, a plant. We're gonna draw, start here on the ground and we'll draw a curve that comes up. And then I'm gonna curve down like this and come back to the bottom. Oh, let's do another one. This one, I'm gonna curve. This one could come up a little higher and then come back down. Watch this, I'm gonna curve up and then curve back down. There you go. Like a little bit taller. A little bit taller and then come back down. You could even draw another one that's shorter there. Maybe I'll draw a short one on this side too. This and like maybe that. another one. Oh, yeah, that's really short. And I'll draw or another. you add different colors to a seaweed too. You could add different colors to the seaweed. Livia, we did it. We finished drawing our fish tank or our fish bowl. We could add more plants. We could add a treasure chest. Yeah. We could even add more fish. We need to color. Yeah, we do. We need to color it. Now this part, we're gonna fast forward our video. So be sure to pause the video and you can take extra time to color your drawings too. If it gives it fast, then you can just pause the video too. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you can pause the video. Should we color really fast? Should we fast forward? Yeah. Okay. I added 
in the little treasure chest. So you guys, if you want, you can add more things to your drawing. So Olivia, do you want to draw right here? You could draw a line that comes up and a line that comes up over here too. Yeah. There you go. And then another line up. And then draw a line that connects the top. Yes. And then you can draw two more lines where the lid opens up. One and two. Okay, now let's color it brown and gold. We also added bubbles to our fish tank. The bubbles are coming out of our fish. I also added another little fish hiding behind the, the grass. Do you want to have bubbles coming out of your treasure chest? Oh yeah. Olivia, give me five. We did it. We finished coloring our fishbowl and it looks so much better all colored in. Did you have fun? Yeah. I had fun drawing and coloring with you too, babe. And you even added pink cheeks. You wanted to add pink cheeks to my drawing too. Go ahead, you can. Oh, that's the belly. <laughs> okay, that's the cheek too. Oh, there's <laughs> two cheeks. Now we can add cheek right here too on this one. I added another yes. <laughs> We do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Go Goodbye. Bye. Oh, did your bunny have fun too? Yeah? Oh, you're smelling your bunny. Does it smell good? No. No? What does it smell like? <laughs>